will Postgres live forever? What's forever, right? What does it mean for software to live? How long does software live? It's all about moving fast. Software that continues to adapt pretty much has an unlimited life cycle. At the moment, Postgres is moving so fast, users are looking for much more features, stability, and tools as well. There's definitely a whole bunch of things on the horizon that I think are going to take Postgres not only in terms of scale uh, to a better place, but in terms of usability, in terms of better data performance. The parallelism that we now have. Even better than what we had. There are major improvements which are going to make uh, partitioning much more usable. The storage abstraction feature which allows us to plug in both uh, something like Zheap. The thing that I'm always uh, kind of looking out on the, on the horizon for is new workloads. Uh, Andres Frude is doing just-in-time compilation of queries which basically makes Postgres even more capable to run analytical situations. It makes analytics queries a lot faster by compiling them down to native code. We're leading a lot of very innovative things. BDB is making a major investment. We're investing very heavily in, uh, in engineering in the community. You'll see that there's some really interesting innovation and some interesting innovation coming down the pipe. So it's going to be exciting for the new users. And at the same time, we have a very large stock engineers who are working on that last mile of, of service that, that we do provide only to our customers, uh, which I think is a, a nice value add. So where Enterprise DB has sort of filled that gap between what the community produces and what a large enterprise needs to really run something efficiently.